Uh, 916, everybody. So at Sweetie Friday time, Maxie's Noodle started as a pop-up in a family restaurant, soon took off on its own, okay? Now Maxie's Noodle has a pop-up at the popular Pearl River Mart Foods. And this morning for Foodie Friday, we're getting a taste of the menu and those noodles that people are mm -hmm. loving. Uh, with us is the owner of Maxie's Noodle, Maxie Lau from Pearl River Mart Foods. We have Joanne Kwan. So welcome to both of hello, you. Hello. Great to have you here. Thank, Thank you, you for so having much us. Yeah, it's good to see you. So Joanne, tell us a little bit about mm -hmm. Pearl River Mart Foods, because not everyone is familiar with yes. what that is exactly. Yeah, Pearl River Mart started in 1971, so this is our 54th year. We're going into our 54th wow. year in New York City. Not easy, started in Chinatown, um, has always been in the Chinatown Soho area. And so we have three stores now, including two at the at Chelsea Market, which is the best food hall in New yes, York City, is. in my opinion, <laughs> and most others. Um, and so we have um, a, a food store that we opened in 2020, and we have, it's half grocery, so you can find all of those amazing new AAPI products. Yeah. And we have four New York City businesses that are with us and rotate in and out. So Maxie's is our newest chef, oh, and we're wonderful. so excited to have her wonton noodle soup, which is so delicious. Um, that and sounds we, amazing. Yeah, it was an absolute yes for us. Uh, so what made you uh, want to bring Maxi's to the pro uh, to the food market? Um, so I, after opening my second restaurant, I always knew I wanted to come out to Manhattan, right? Um, so it was just like the perfect timing. Where were you? Um, I'm in Queens. Okay, I'm in okay. Flushing, Queens. Yeah. Yeah. You have two there? I have two there. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So um, when Joanne reached out and said that you know want to do this collab and you know ask me if I was interested no brainer I was like I'm yeah. there yeah. <laughs> and how are things been going so far um it's been going great um they've been ordering a lot <laughs> <laughs> so tell us tell us a little bit about Maxie's Noodle okay so um I started Maxie's Noodle because of my mother um it was always her dream to open up a wonton noodle shop but oh. sadly she passed away from cancer oh, so sorry. thank you so she um you know never fulfilled her dream and after she passed I took it upon myself knowing that I always wanted to open a restaurant and it just, again, timing and kind of like mom just daring me to the Aww. path of maybe this is a sign. So yeah. I here did, you are. yeah, here I am. And it took <laughs> off. <laughs> yeah, it took off. And you were not in the food business prior. No, I uh, actually worked for Home Depot. Right. Um, <laughs> had a nice comfy office job and then complete 360, never worked in a restaurant, came into the restaurant scene and um, just, started from there. It pulled you in, it sucked <laughs> oh, yeah. you in. So what did you bring for us today? Okay, so um, at the shop, um, our menu is very small. Um, we have four types of noodles. So um, our best seller is our duck egg noodles. Mm -hmm. um, it's actually my uncle's recipe. So it's Ooh. custom made just for us. You can't buy this oh, egg noodle anywhere family else. Family restaurant. Yes. Our family uh, recipe. recipe yes. That's wonderful. Um, and then I have the flat rice noodle, which is like a second uh, best seller. Yeah. Um, we also have udon and um, the skinny rice noodle, which is the vermicelli. Um, so we have four types of noodles for um, customers to choose, and then we also have six toppings. Okay. So it's like a mix and match. You can customize however you like. Oh, right. wow. Um, yeah, so out of the six toppings, so we have our wonton, which is um, mainly shrimp, 90% shrimp and a smear of pork. That's mm -hmm. our very like most popular yeah. go-to. Um, and then we have our beef stew that we braise for hours. Nice. Um, and then the day's fish ball. We have dumplings, the zajang, which is strips of pork and like a tomato base, um, and then our fried fish skin. So I these say, are. I've are, had sorry, I've <laughs> had tens of thousands of wontons and dumplings in my life, but hers are humongous, and yeah. they're made all of shrimp, which is yeah. very yes. rare to find. Um, do not try them in one bite because I did that. They're too massive. <laughs> they're so big. <laughs> yeah, because you don't find them that big. No, usually, places. yeah, it's like you, bite size. Though. Yes, traditional wontons are bite size, so they're small. Mine are obviously super sized, yes. they're like <laughs> ping pong ball size, so that's what bigger you know, than a ping pong ball. Right, right, yeah. right. So we stand out because I super size my stuff. Oh, I love yes. that. And how long do you have the, the, the restaurants before you swap them out in the in the market? Um, Maxi will be with us for six months. Okay. Yeah, so plenty of time to come by yeah. um, Chelsea Market, and um, yeah, we have we also have um, Bows there and Kimbap and yeah. Boba, so we're always trying to represent the best of API yeah. foods, and there's so much, so there's always something. Thing new. Right. I do love that this is all family recipes. What mm -hmm. does your family think about your success and the fact that you're not only in Queens, but now at least for six months you'll be in Manhattan? Um, I'm actually opening my third restaurant <gasps> in Manhattan Chinatown. Oh so, my gosh, well, congratulations. Thank you, thank you. So that's um, coming soon, January. Okay. 
Yep. So you're working on that now. Where exactly will it be? Um, we that's will awesome. be at 68 Mont Street between okay. Canal and Bayard. Yes, yes. that's amazing. Congratulations. You, what was you. this over here, by the way? You have two more okay. over here. Um, yeah, so um, we have well, some little bit of appetizers um, to share with you guys. So we have the curry fish bowl, which is like a street food in Hong Kong. Okay. That's very popular. You have everyone and everyone. You know, you can be an adult, child, yeah. whoever, whatever. You're, they're walking around with a stick of fish balls. Okay. This is like a no thing. <laughs> and then we have just um, some vegetable with oyster sauce. Yeah. Um, this is our beef stew. It comes in an appetizer form, or you can, again, because it's one of the toppings, you can mix it into your noodles like I have right. there. I love yep. that, that it can be And do you sell this bad boy? Yes, I sell that so bad boy. Good. So good. Oh, that's very recipe it, it, also. It's spicy. We like that. <laughs> it's garlicky, it's spicy. It, it, it works very well with the noodles. Okay. okay. And remind folks again where all your restaurants are right now so they can come visit you. Um, so the first one is on 38th Avenue, um, downtown Flushing. Um, yes, and then um, the second one is also in Flushing, but it's um, on Main Street. Yeah. So it's right off the LIE. That one's a lot bigger, it's three times the size. The first one on 38th Avenue is our, what I call the OG shop. It's like the first the small, small, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's tiny there, but it's very cozy. Um, and then again, um, you know, Pearl River, River Foods, Park. yes, we'll be at Chelsea Market for six months rotation. And then our newest one will be in Manhattan, Chinatown. Awesome. Come in January. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you Congratulations. So Thank that you. Is great yeah, stuff. That's great. Your mom would be proud of you. Yes. I hope so. I hope yes. so. Yes. Oh, yes. She is. Thank Absolutely. you.